Hey, hey everybody. It's been quite a while since I've had a chance to do a video up at the garden. So I figured I'd just take a couple of minutes and just talk about kind of what I learned from my adventures in growing food. So number one was, yes, we grew food and it was awesome. I'm literally so impressed. I mean, this is our third grouping of food going through this little section. Those beets are amazing. Uh, yes, my tomatoes are a chaotic, incredible mess, but they're also super cool and fabulously tasty. And I'm gonna make yellow salsa, so I'm very excited about that. So I learned about tomatoes. They really do need strong sports because they get so big. I learned about lettuces. Oh, wait till you see these lettuces. <laughs> they're so cool. Check these guys out, they've got speckles. I love lettuce. I learned so much about lettuce from Barb this summer. I'm eternally grateful. So I've learned about tomatoes, that they need help. I've learned about lettuce, that it's epic. And I've learned so much other stuff. I've learned to grow food. I've learned to turn crappy soil into something that makes things happen. And I'm really grateful to be here. I also have learned something else. I'm a huge fan of dunes. And probably folks notice that I always call folks humans. As I was re-going through the book, I remember I read the passage where Paul meets the Reverend Mother, and she explains that a long time ago, humans had turned their thinking over to machines, and it caused a split. It caused them to become weak. And half of the species devolved down further towards their animal self. They lost that higher thinking skill. The other ones remained as human. They could think, they could discern, they were special. So you, my good humans, are special. Take care, everyone. Hope you're doing okay. I'm gonna spend some time harvesting <laughs> fabulous food here from the garden. I am feeling so darn lucky that I got a chance to do this this summer, to learn so much. Amen. Take care, everybody. Love y'all.